What's up you guys? I'm so excited to be on here today and share with you guys a few items that I have picked up over the last few weeks. I I haven't been shopping a whole lot, um, but I have been saving this stuff, I want to say for the last three weeks or so, because I did a haul earlier. I didn't want to just do another haul like right away. So I've kind of just been sitting on these items. So the first item that I purchased came from my Teresa. If you follow me on Instagram, you might already have seen this. I saw it last year and I've been trying to talk myself out of it. Uh, but I couldn't get it out of my head and it's not a piece that I've seen a whole lot of um, which is the reason why I really opted to purchase it because I just I, I loved it this is exactly like the box the shirt has the same design it is gorgeous and I just thought, I don't know, this is, it was so different and unique and I just had to have it. Uh, this is a limited edition piece. So I don't remember what the name of the artist is, but I will write the name um, right over here. But it is a limited edition piece and it's really, really beautiful. I, I, I don't know, it, it's so, um, I don't know, it's really different than anything that I've seen. Uh, and it reminds me of another t-shirt that I have that I say is my absolute favorite t-shirt where it's just I don't know why this t-shirt speaks to me but it this t-shirt speaks to me so um, I actually wanted to buy it in a large but uh, it sold out and medium was the only size that they had left and I actually have worn it do you see the makeup stain there already? but it, it fits a little snug but I love it regardless, and I'm really, really thrilled with this purchase. Next, I have a item from Dior. So I was on Rodeo uh, several weeks ago, I want to say even two months ago, and I saw the sales girl with a beautiful uh, or, or a version of this, and I just really loved it and then when I saw this version I was completely 100% in on this item. This I have not worn yet. As I've mentioned with my hair situation I kind of thought that this would also help. <laughs> if you guys see my grays are coming in really really strong so I'm going to see if I can just follow through and let them grow out. And in the meantime, I can just cover it up with this gorgeous hat that honestly, you guys, if it's really snug, I really, really love it. What do we think? I don't know. I just think it's really funky. And if you have everything, I always pair everything back with like a white t-shirt and jeans or like white t-shirt and like Bermuda shorts or keeping it really really simple and then just throwing this on on a bad hair day or on a bun day whatever and I just really really love this piece. I am a, a serious hat lover you guys. I have been purchasing hats since I was like 14 um, so I never purchased a luxury hat before. But when I saw this one, I was like, yes, <laughs> I need it. Um, I love that it's denim. I It's a lot more casual than the leather version. Or I'm not even sure if it was real leather or pleather. I'm not 100% sure. But I really, really love and this one. Lastly, so. you guys, I purchased my very first ever piece of Chanel ready to wear. And it's right here. I am still, I think, disbelief that I own this, to be honest, because ready to wear was not something that I ever imagined myself purchasing. So when I went to ask about this item uh, on Rodeo, the salesperson couldn't have been any nicer. And she gave me a list of stores that had the piece. Actually, nobody had the piece. But she did say that some stores had it in transit and I was looking for a size 48. I wasn't actually sure what size I should purchase, um, to be quite honest. A 50 became available. She gave me all of the information of all of the stores that were getting this in, in a size 48, no, 46 or 50 because no one had ordered 48. So the 50, someone actually ordered this. 
and I had gotten it out of my head that I was not going to get it. I was not going to get to try it on. And then one morning uh, after dropping off my daughter, I got a call from the Boston store from Karen at the Boston store. Person declined to purchase this and because of that, I now own it. And I honestly tried it on. I played with it. I loved it. I am so excited to own this piece, especially because it is one of Karl Lagerfeld's last collections. I think that's the reason why I really wanted this piece. Uh, truth be told, that I, I don't think I would have purchased it had that not been the case. I can wear it open or I can wear it this way. And, you know, I see a lot of people like kind of mimicking the... Um, the runway look but that's obviously not how I intend on wearing it because I have to make it more wearable for my lifestyle even though it's white and I have a baby but I don't know I just really love it I I, I'm, I, I, I don't even know what to say about it I'm still surprised by this purchase and I, I can't believe you guys I, I own this shirt Oh my god look even the hanger has and honestly you guys ready to wear is not something that i ever intended on you know getting into and kind of like handbags or shoes like once you make a purchase it's i don't know like my my it's just all skewed now you know what i mean like i i just i don't know <laughs> Um, the other reason I chose to purchase that is because I don't have that much room for handbags anymore, to be quite honest. I kind of have to restructure my closet just because I, in order for me to wear everything, I have to have it, you know, out on display because if it's like put away or tucked away, I will not wear it and it will just be like kind of sit there. So I need all of my items out and like at a easy grab and go kind of thing so i am definitely someone who will not continue to buy as many handbags i'm not saying i won't buy any more but i am more i don't have that much more room for handbags you guys i, I genuinely don't and unless i kind of purge a lot uh, and kind of restructure my closet then I'm that's I think that was the other reason why I got into the uh, I purchased the um, Chanel shirt just because you know I, I have room for clothes um, because I can you know get rid of a lot of clothes and then make room for that so I don't know let me know what you guys think um, and yeah i'm so excited I, I was so excited to share with you guys even though it took me like three weeks. did make this purchase on march 22nd so yeah i've had it for a month now and i just i, I i'm serious i think i it was one of the, the times in my life that i've kind of been in shock um one that i was able to have this shirt that was really really hard to find um and that I, I like that it lives here <laughs> so that's it you guys uh, let me know what you guys think or your opinions on the shirt and if you want me to style it for you I will go ahead and insert a few ways that I intend on wearing it uh, if you want me to do a lookbook on it I'm happy to do it as but well in any case you guys I love you guys uh, you guys are really amazing human beings and i love making videos and sharing items with you guys um i love that we are all happy for one another and i don't know i i, I really really love this community you guys um thank you so much for watching and i will talk to you guys later bye